Okay guys, so first you saw me spray down my hair. Now I took the back of my hair and I started like, took the gel, cause I brushed it out cause my hair is this short. So you see a little ponytail back there. Now I'm taking the front of my hair and most people do it in sections, but I'm just gonna put the gel and I oiled my hair first. I'm just, I don't want gel all throughout my hair. So I'm just gonna do this. And I'm gonna go ahead and try to make me a little, some books, some baby hairs, just on the side, cause I'm gonna do a bang. So I got the Shine Jam hold. And I'm just gonna, I'm gonna slap it on the edge. And I'm gonna slap it on this edge. Just about that much. And I'm getting my little baby hair brush. Okay, I'm gonna take my baby hair brush and get my mirror. And I'm gonna try to create me some baby hairs. So you know I suffer from traction alopecia. So I'm working on curing that. It's only in two spots, so I'll share my journey on how I'm doing that. Okay, so we got that. We're gonna take and put our melting band over it. And then we're gonna take So I'm taking about three plastic bands. Brushing my hair up. And I'm gonna try to include the little ponytail that I got in the back. Okay. And there's my little bun. Okay, now I'm gonna take some oil sheen. This one is some ISO Plus, okay? And anything I use, I'm gonna link in my bio where to get it from my uh, website. So my website will take you to my Amazon links. I am an affiliate or Amazon associate, so I do get a little commission off of whatever you buy. So thank you for supporting my page. <laughs> and so um, I'm gonna go ahead. This is um, an old ponytail. So I want to revive it. I'm going to spray it with some oil sheen. If it really needed reviving, I would do the whole, um, you know, conditioner revival. Okay. I'm going to start at the bottom, brush it, especially over here. See that? That's horrible. So I'm going to grab it at the bottom. And see the oil sheen just makes it easier to comb through. It gets it through that section. Okay, so once I have all that brushed out, it comes with a comb, two combs, no, yeah, two combs, okay, and a drawstring, okay, so I take the comb, and I put it right here, and I take the other one, I put it right there. I need enough room for my bang, because it does come with a bang, okay, and I want that because I'm trying to grow my edges out. Now, that bang has three combs. Okay, and it takes up a lot of space, so that bang has to start like right here in order for it to look good. Okay, so I should put my bang. Let me go ahead and put my bang on. All right, so again, three combs. You open it up, you start the comb like right by where you're gonna put your ponytail, you snap it down. Okay, then you take the other combs, push them up, snap them down. And then you have your bang. Okay, now that I have my bang brushed out, I'm gonna go ahead and take my ponytail. And I'll link the ponytail, like I said, in my um, shop. So I'll take it and I put the comb right here where this section is. Stab that comb in there, come around, 
that the comb in the back of my head. Okay, and I'll take the drawstring, pull drawstring holding my head down. Pull it as tight as I can get it. And then pull that little thing down. Okay. Okay, then you take the string and you wrap the string around. Okay, then you take a open pen and you take it and you pin the string up into your pony. Now, if you wanted to have like a realistic look, then you take a piece of hair from each each of the one of the sides, okay? Like a nice thick piece like this. Okay? And you wrap it around. Okay, then bring it around to the front. Make sure it's nice and flat when you get to the front. Make sure it's over the hair. And then you can take another pin. Okay, so that's how you kind of cover it. Okay. Now this is a lower, I made it low. But you can build it up high. Like you can have it high if you want it. But I made mine just a little low. I just wanted a little low pony. Okay. And so that's how you put on your pony. Now I'm going to work on my makeup.